One, two, three. One, two. Is this three. how you do CPR, everyone? <laughs> I've got this really bad habit for a cop. Once I start working on a case, I can't think about anything else. I'm exhausted. I haven't gotten a wink of sleep all night. Something's bothering me about this murder, but I just can't seem to put my finger on what it is. Is this the police station? Oh, okay. Hi, Carla. Hey. How are you doing today? Hi, Doug. Not too bad. Is Tyler here yet? No, not that I know of. He's late. Of course he is. God damn it. What kind of partner do I have? Where's the office? I don't even know where I'm going. Is this the office? Yo, what is wrong with the camera? <laughs> Hi, Carla. How are you? Hey. Carla Valenti and Sergeant Sergeant Tyler. He's a sergeant. Oh my hey, goodness! Hey Carla, can you tell your partner to pay me back that hundred bucks he owes me? I've been waiting six months for it now. Can't help you there, Jeffrey. Talk to him about it. Yeah, why He's are you been telling me? me like the plague. Plus, yeah, you know you're the only money. one he listens to. Oh my God! Catch you later, Jeffrey. It's not my problem. You guys are gambling. Hi, Carla. Hi, Garrett. Oh wait, Carla. I got some results back on the tests we did for that restaurant murder. Great. As soon as Tyler gets here, we'll come and see you. Okay. I'll be at my desk all morning. Cool. Can I just go into my office now? Thank you. <laughs> all right. Tyler hates it when anyone touches his stuff. But he's not here. He wouldn't know. Uh, anyway. Tyler is still not here. <gasps> I better try to give him a ring. Yeah, let's call him. Tyler, why are you late? Um. No, look at yo yo. But it helps me think. Uh, right. <laughs> is that how. Is that how yo yo's work? <laughs> oh my god. No, let's put it back. Jesus Christ. Okay, I, I just need I just need a call. There we go. Oh god, I think this is the nude scene. Oh no. Yo, Tyler, stop banging your girlfriend you know, and come here. Know what time it is? Oh shit. Get a move on. The waitress is coming this morning to flesh out the composite on the killer. I'm on my way. All right, well, I'm gonna take a drink of water. Wait for him to come over here. I think I have to switch to him to like make him come over here. But I gotta make Carla less stressed. All right, um. I don't think there's anything else she can do. I think she just has to be at her desk. Hmm. Yeah, I, I may have to censor real quick. Because I think this is the part where she, like, takes off her clothes and be like, Don't leave me! But I think that's what she's gonna do. Valium. 60% reduction on Valium when you order. Receive more than 300 types of tranquilizers delivered to your door less than 24 hours wherever you live. If you're stressed out by life, act now by tranquilizing yourself. Hi, Carla. I'm sorry I wasn't able to give you any news for a while. I've been very busy with my job. I'll drop by your place as soon as I can and tell you about the latest adventures. Lots of kisses, Tommy. It's all happened before. Kirsten. What's that supposed to mean? Huh? Okay. New York Tower, okay. Crime raises by 15%. Database. Oh. Alright. Yep, yeah, let's just turn on the light. What the 
hell is that? What? <laughs> what did I get? Um. Okay, let me switch over to Tyler. I gotta be careful, though. <sighs> Tyler's apartment. Get up, dude. You have to go to work. Stay a little longer. Mm, sorry, babe, but I really gotta go. I'll make some coffee. Okay, I'll grab a shower, get dressed, and then I'm out of here. All right. Where's your bathroom? Is this your bathroom? Hey, all right. Oh, God. Please don't show peen! Thank you! <laughs> oh, God, no! It's starting! I may have to switch this. Oh no! Tyler gets his own special soundtrack. Did you guys know that? I like how that music was only playing when he was taking a shower! Plus five for peeing! Oh, there's a card there? What the hell? All right, I don't, I don't freaking know what that is, but all right. All right, let me put some clothes on. <laughs> His girlfriend looks extremely pissed off. All right, got that. Um, A statuette of socks. One of the characters in my favorite video game. It's a really weird comment, but okay. Okay. Let's go out there. No boobs, please. Alright, we're safe so far. Um... Thanks for the coffee, dear. Go back to bed, Sam. You're gonna catch a death of cold like that. I'm not cold. Oh, look, Sam, please don't start. I got no intention of dying today. I'm sick of living in fear like this. Every morning, I'm, I'm terrified that something's gonna happen to you. Um... I know how you feel, Sam. You just need some time, that's all. I don't like to see you like this. You know that, baby. Don't, don't, don't whip out what anything. Quit? <laughs> we could move to Florida and take over my parents' store. We'd have a normal life. We could have a baby. Whoa! 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 <laughs> First of all, I get it. You don't, you don't want your boyfriend to die in the line of duty. That's a very valid reason of being scared. But that is so random! Let's move out to Florida, take over my parents' store, and have a baby. What the fuck? <laughs> um... Take over your parents' store? Can you see me selling shoes from behind a counter while kids are out there killing each other in the streets? I belong here where I can do some good. That's not very really supportive Florida. of your partner, dude. What the fuck? Kind of girl. Yo, get a better girlfriend, Tyler. This is messed up. I'm sorry. Like, yeah, she has the right to be scared, but you don't have the right to be like, let's just quit your job. Like, screw you. No. There's lots of pizza in there. Alright, can I leave? God. Take my coat, too. Take the coat! All right, goodbye. <laughs> Aren't you going to kiss me? Do you guys want to kiss her? Do you guys want to kiss her? Or do you want me to just walk out the door and be a dick right now? <laughs> what should I do? Oh, God. Get to Carla's office. All right, I got nothing else. Tyler to be single. I mean, this girl is like, damn. You can't do that. In a relationship, you got to be equal with one another. You know, give or take. You can't just randomly throw, let's have a baby in the middle of that. <laughs> that was so random. Oh, we can turn on music. 
I think he's just gonna kiss her. I don't think he's gonna, like, whip out his penis or anything like that. I love you, Tyler. Yeah, just calm down, okay, with the baby. <laughs> David Cage, did you just did you just give him this kind of okay? I'm not I'm not gonna say anything anymore. I just uh Hi Tyler. Hey. Oh uh Carl is looking for you. Yeah, I know. So, you ready for retirement, man? Yeah, <laughs> I'm working on it. Working on it. Right. Oh dear. Oh, we gotta what's avoid that guy. It? Hey, what's up? He's probably gonna ask us for money. Quick, run to the office. Hey, Tyler. Hello. What's up, Frank? Hey, oh, Tyler. No. What do you know? No. Just the guy I was looking for. I have no money. Leave me alone. Oh, shit. You remember that hundred bucks I loaned He's you about six months now. ago? I'd really like for you to get that back to me as soon as possible. Like maybe now, for example. Jeffrey, don't tell me you're prepared to ruin a beautiful friendship for a hundred lousy dollars. This may surprise you, but yes. So give up the cash before I start to get really angry. Yo, let me make you a deal. I'll play you a game of b-ball for your hundred bucks. If you win, I'll give you two hundred bucks right then. But if you lose, we cool. You'll give me two hundred bucks if I win. You got my word, man. Uh-huh. All right, you're on. But don't even think about not paying me if you lose, because that... Don't worry, Jeffrey. I'll come by and see you when I get five minutes. We just don't see him. <laughs> hey, Carla. The waitress hasn't come in yet? She won't be long. Garrett got the lab results. Shall we go? All right, let me hang up my coat. I'll be right with you. Okay, see you in a minute. All right, let me hang up the coat. Can I look at my like computer and stuff like that? So we can see if he has any emails or something. Is that how you type on a computer? Pleasure. Penis enlarger. Gain up to five inches of sheer pleasure. Results guaranteed. Why wait? Free estimate. Oh dear. Virus. Men's already infected to install. Attach file to prevent infection of your system. Your friends at Quantic Dream Software. Oh my god. Tyler, I'm sorry we're quarreled this morning. I'm so scared that something might happen to you. I love you, Sam. What? Oh, is that the girlfriend? Probably the girlfriend. Life sentence. Okay, we got nothing on there. Alright, that's it. Just got some spam mail and one email from the girlfriend. <laughs> Alright, Carla, let's go. So, what do you want to start with? Did you find anything on the coffee cup? The only prints we found belonged to the waitress. That's impossible, man. That cup was half empty. Somebody must have drank it. What about the pool of blood in the stall? You're not going to believe this. The blood wasn't from the victim. It was from the killer. What was he doing bleeding in the stall? I have I don't know. absolutely no idea. What did you find on the knife? Got some good prints off it. They matched those found on the fork and glass at the suspect's table. So, the murderer was definitely at that table. Anything on the blade? I'm getting to that. We definitely had blood from the victim, but the weird thing is we also found blood from the killer. Were there any prints on the book that was under the table? Yep, and they matched the ones on the fork and the glass. This guy's shaking his head so too much. So it was much. definitely his book. It looked like a fairly old book. Maybe we can get some more stuff out of it. Did you get the list of calls that came through the telephone at the restaurant? Yep. There were about a dozen in the four hours that preceded the murder. I'll send you a list by email. So, what do you think about all that? I don't have any explanation for the blood in this stall. 
The victim could have wounded the killer during a struggle, but it doesn't make sense that it would be in the stall. It's as though the killer wounded himself. Hey, why not? You get clumsy fools in every other profession. Why not killers? That's kind of a flimsy explanation, Garrett. Um... Uh, to each his own, Carla. I do the testing, you figure out the reason why. Thanks for your help, Garrett. See you later. So, what do we do now? You go take care of the composite. I'm gonna go check with the coroner and see if he got anything from the body. Okay. Catch you later. Alright. Oh, we're back with Lucas. When Marcus and I were kids, we were inseparable. He's the one who took care of me after our parents died. We kind of grew apart after he became a priest. But he's still the only person I really trust. The only one who might believe that I had nothing to do with all this mess. Is that guy dead? Mm, looks homeless. Oh, I thought he was dead. Poor guy. Oh my god. In this freezing cold. Excuse me. I'm happy to see you. I missed you. It's been a while. Marcus! Two years. So tell me what's happened, Lucas. I've killed a man, Marcus. <laughs> These 2009 ass it graphics make me orgasm. <laughs> it's like I was possessed in a sort of trance, like I was a puppet on a string. I saw what I was doing, but I was powerless to stop it. My God. I can't believe this, Lucas. Also, I like how they're talking about the murder out in the open you. in public. You're not capable of something like that. This murder. I exactly how did it happen? Well, after work last night, I stopped at a little diner to get something to eat. I read a book at my table, I think. And after, it's just a black hole. I don't remember anything. Right up until I found myself in the toilets with a knife in my hand. It, it, was, it was horrible. And there's this, The too. bird's there again on you the statue. cut your wrists? Before the murder, I, I carved these symbols on my arms with a knife. I don't know if they mean anything. Who else have you told all of this to? No one. You're the only person that I can trust. You say that you were in a sort of a trance. But what do you mean by that? Are you talking about magic? Or sorcery? Or something like that? Marcus, I don't have an explanation. I'm just telling you what happened, that's all. I'm only certain about one thing. I'm not the one who really killed that man. It wasn't me! While I was doing this... horrible thing, I saw something, or, or rather someone. Was somebody else there with you? No, it was, it was like a sort of vision. I saw a man in the middle of hundreds of candles, and, and there was this little girl. You saw a little girl? There was this little girl! <laughs> she seemed alone, lost. She, she asked me to help her. What happened to me, Marcus? What am I supposed to do now? You know me better than anyone, Marcus. Help me. Listen, Lucas, I... I'm a bit lost here. This whole story is just so bizarre. You think? Maybe you need some professional help. Most cases of possession are known to actually stem from psychiatric problems. Marcus, I don't have a psychiatric problem. I'm not crazy. <laughs> I am a priest, Lucas. The dialogue The fact that you have me. taken a life is a very serious matter. I told you that it wasn't me, Marcus. It's not me. Oh, I did not do it. I didn't you hit still her. Never listen to me, <laughs> Lucas. Don't. Y'all are talking about this in public, my right? My hey, they're not going into some secluded area. I'm not a murderer, Marcus. You're the only person I can trust. I'm just asking you to believe me. Believe well. when do you believe. I can, but I can't do anything that goes against my beliefs. Look, I, I need to get some answers. I'll, I'll call you. Here. You need this more than I do. <laughs> Marcus, you know that I don't believe in all that. Oh, I'll just take it. We're probably, like, gonna be possessed Thanks. again anyway. And also it gave me one life, so that's good. The bird is there again! Uh-oh. What's going on? Uh-oh! What is this dumb kid doing?! 
That kid, he's gonna slip on the ice. You I've stupid kid! Him. Run! The cop in the restaurant. Uh oh. If I don't do something, the child will die. What do you guys want to do? Do you want to save the kid or just leave? Save the kid or leave. What am I gonna do? Pick right now. Pick right now. Are we gonna be a hero or are we just gonna dip? <laughs> Let the kid drown. <laughs> Weren't you y'all gonna visit the grave? I know, right? That's what I thought they were doing too. They they didn't do that apparently. They just talked about their plan in, in public. Okay, we got two votes for leave. <laughs> oh my god. I told you, whatever choice you guys want, I'll do it. It doesn't matter how terrible it is, because this game is awful anyway, so. Uh um Okay, there's more votes to save the kid, so we're gonna save the kid. Check out that dive. Oh, right. Okay, hang on. Hurry up, Lucas! There he is. He's lost consciousness. What? Is that? Okay, Quick. I don't know. I've got to go back up before I run out of air. This is this is how you uh, swim, everybody. <laughs> Oh god, damn it, how many freaking times? Yeah, that kid's dead. That kid is freaking dead. Lucas, just run, just run. <laughs> Wait, do I have to save the kid or do I have to run? I don't even know what I'm doing. Uh. One, two, three. One, two. Is this three. how you do CPR, everyone? One, two, three. One, two, three. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> I, I can't take this game. Why is it so stupid? Call three, two, four. Kid just fell into the water. Send an ambulance right away. <laughs> Man, what courage. The kid would have died. That guy's a hero. He dove into freezing water. Oh God! It's the same officer the would have made it out of there without him. The cop recognized me. We both knew it. It's hard to say why he didn't turn me in. Maybe he decided I was even. I had taken a life and given one back. You're not gonna Nothing arrest this guy. Me. I was still wanted for murder by the police. But when I you left know that's the killer, and you're just gonna I let him go just because he saved a kid. Again without cringing. Are you? I'm cringing at this whole game, Lucas. Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> okay, who do you want to play now, as guys? Lucas, Carla, or Tyler? So Lucas is going to the bank. Uh, Carla is going to the morgue because she's gonna talk to the guy about the body. And uh, Tyler's gonna do some shenanigans at the police station. I think he's gonna get his money back. Uh, I think that's what he's doing. <laughs> so you guys pick. Because eventually we're gonna have to play all of them, but you guys get to pick who you want to go first. Oh my god. That CPR scene was horrible. Carla, Tyler, Daddy Tyler, Carla. Uh, no, one, no one likes Lucas, huh? No one, <laughs> no one likes him. <laughs> um, all right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick Carla because I'm gonna be the deciding factor of this, I guess. The body. Any day now. Okay, we're going to get started. Uh, oh, he's British. If you prefer, you can wait outside. I'd rather stay here if you don't mind. I've studied some medicine. I've seen dead bodies. That's a oh. really weird comment. <laughs> As you wish. Whoa, those sound effects. No apparent hematoma on the body. Two broken fingernails on the right hand. How do I do that thing? I don't Large understand how to do that. The, the Simon the Says cranium. thing. Uh, mm, fracture of the occipital bone. Oh, oops. Um, 
I don't know how to do it. Normal dilation in. Um, I'm I'm making her more anxious. Pupils. Nope, that ain't it either. Three knife wounds. Should have done the tutorial. Fifth ribs with in David the proximity Cage. of the heart. Uh, the blade was driven in deeply. Uh, the stab seemed to have been delivered from the front and moved from left to right. What? One stab. I got one though. Cut the aorta. <laughs> Carla's like right <laughs> turning to France. <laughs> oh my god! I'm gonna done? kill her. The blade slipped right through the ribs to cut the arteries. It was definitely the knife wounds that caused his death? Yes. The three arteries leading to the heart were cut. Why does he sound like, um, what's that guy's name in James Bond? The dude who gives him the all the weapons? The Do you think the killer had some knowledge of anatomy? Yeah, it's not impossible, but I doubt that someone who understood human anatomy would do this. You'd really have to be deranged to want to provoke a slow and agonizing death in this manner. I uh, saw a case like this once before. It was a while back now, in the 90s, I think. Exactly the same. Three stabs around the heart, each one cutting a main artery. It really struck me at the time. I wondered how such a thing were possible. It was the, um, what was that name again? Karsten or Kirsten, something like that. Kirsten. Yes, that's it, Kirsten. You know about that case? Not yet. I'm sure as hell gonna find out. That mysterious email was onto something. All right, we're gonna go with Tyler next because everyone hates Lucas. <laughs> I made uh, Carla extremely depressed though, it's not good. Come in. H hello, detective. Hello, Mrs. Oh, Morris. it's the lady. Hello. Thanks for taking the trouble to come down. Please take a seat. That was a weird camera now, like. We're zoom gonna in. try and assemble a composite photo of the suspect you saw. We have a computer program to help us. You'll see it's really simple. It's kind of like a video game. Okay, have you ever played a video fart. game, Mrs. Morrison? No. Ah, it doesn't matter. You're gonna do fine. The most important thing is to try to remember exactly what happened. The program consists of several types of Please tell me we get to customize his face. You scroll through them until it looks like the man you saw. You understand? Yes. Well, I think I do. Okay. Let's go. <laughs> oh my god! You guys, we get to pick how uh, we think Lucas looks. Do you guys want to make it accurate to what actually Lucas looks like? Or do you want to make it look ridiculous? Because <laughs> I kind of want to make him look stupid just for the jokes. Oh my god, Tyler is depressed by the way. Holy shit, let me take a look at the options though. <laughs> make him look like a damn monster? Okay, hang on. Hang on, hang on. Let's give him the most ridiculous, like, things that look completely nothing like, uh, Lucas. Just something that's, like, out of the ordinary. Do that. Um. Oh my god, I'm dying. <laughs> oh my god. Are, are you guys okay with this? We can make him look like this? Oh my god. Yeah, that's that's totally what the guy looked like at the diner. That's who murdered him. Our friend Jack Sparrow. Now, is this the face of the person you saw? Yes. At least, that's how I remember him. Thank you very See, much. Zero to 25% not at all We're similar. We're gonna get this picture out to all the airports, trains, and bus stations, and to all of our patrolmen. If this guy is still in New York, we're gonna find him. I can't. And go buy yourself a video game. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Whoa, what's happening? <laughs> yup, that's him, 100%. That's Chandler from Friends in Disguise. I was burning Why are you fever. throwing up, dude? What's going on? Over. The migraine was back and drilling holes into my brain. You should have brought your when medicine you with off, you. I couldn't keep any food down. My body seemed to be fighting against something, but I still didn't know what. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. 
Just keep you not a depresso, okay? Okay, let's get out of here. Thank you. Gotta just live my life no matter what. Don't raise any suspicions. Despite the state I was in, I decided to go to work as though nothing had happened. Yeah, that's probably a bad idea. I'm in charge of computer maintenance in the Naser and Jones Bank. Oh. Uh... I share my office with Warren. Hey, Warren. Can I talk to Warren? Do you know what time it is? What's wrong with you? Why are you judging me, Warren? I had a little problem on the way back. I'm in. sick, I had to you go dick. Back home and change my clothes. Do you know what time it is? Don't you? Do you, what's wrong with you? Do you have a problem? Yeah, it's called being sick. Mind your own damn business. <laughs> oh God, here we go again. I don't know how to do this. I did it wrong again. Mm mm. Can anyone look up how to do the Uno um, controls on a controller? Because I'm not using my keyboard. So I don't know what I'm doing. I shouldn't have done that. It's the other button. There we go. Tiffany and I. Oh. About two years ago, I guess. Oh, this is the ex-girlfriend. I then. haven't been able to throw it away yet. Dude, you gotta throw it away. You gotta move on. Don't be weird. <gasps> we got another life. Perfect. Um. What's with the freaking satanic music? Oh my <gasps> god. He's working! What? Murderer! <laughs> Murderer! Lucas? You okay? The, the joystick? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. Thanks, Sean. Yep, totally fine. Maybe I should- Oh, God. Hello? Who's calling? Lucas Kane. Hello, Lucas. Oh, hello, Tiffany. Oh, ex-girlfriend. I left a message on your machine last night. Um, I'd like to come and pick up some stuff at your place. Could I come over tonight? Yes. I should be back home around 8 o'clock tonight. That way he won't get depressed. Okay, <laughs> I'm just trying to keep him calm. Are you doing okay, Lucas? Yeah, I'm I gotta fine. let you go. I'm doing a thing here. Bye. I'm fine. Oh god, no, I, I'm not ready! Fuck! I almost did it again! Ah! I got it though, I got two, um... Two buttons though, so I think I have to do it really fast. Oh god, he keeps calling. Oh. Way to spill the coffee, my guy. Hello? Yes, sir. We'll get on that right away. Station 62 is down. I'll go. <clears throat> You're no, gonna clean up I'll, I'll the, the coffee? Whatever you say. No, I don't want to go. Can I just stay here? God damn it. Alright, I guess I'm going. Fuck this. Also, this man didn't clean up the coffee. He just left it on his, like, freaking thing. Uh, Nightbot is still- Oh god, I didn't change it. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Ah. Uh... I always never change it. Hmm. All right. Sorry about that, guys. Let me fix that right now, so people can stop asking. Jesus Christ, this game is like ridiculous, and and the fact that the controls are like you have to do it so fast that it will register that you're actually hitting those like directions on the on the joy uh, joystick or the analog is kind of crazy. All right, is it gonna log me in or what's happening? Let me change this. Uh, indigo prophecy. All right, I'll just do the Steam link. It's all right. All right. <clears throat> okay, that should be fine now.
All right, are you guys ready? Let's go back into the stupidness. Okay, so I have to go to the other side of the office. So this way. And then... Oh my god! What the fuck? Alright. <laughs> Let's just pretend that didn't happen. It's uh, this one, right? Bugs! I hate bugs! What is that Emperor Palpatine?! <laughs> what the hell?! Is he high?! What is going on?! Oh, oh, okay, um... Oh, I did it! I did it! I did it! I did it! I'm doing it, guys! Hey! I figured it out! Okay. Okay, run! Oh shit! 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 Oh my god! What the hell is going on? This man has to be on drugs. There's no other explanation for this. Combat roll. <laughs> what the hell? Why is this so stupid? <laughs> How about he's the only one hallucinating, and everyone in the office is like, What's wrong with Lucas? <laughs> Is Lucas okay? Does he need to go home or something? What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, this guy's high. There's no way you can do that. What the fuck? Oh god, uh. It's the guy we murdered, isn't it? <laughs> Two faces of the same serpent. One in our world. <laughs> this game again. Woe to he who sees both sides of the snake. No. <laughs> oh my god. Please tell Lucas. me this. Yeah. Lucas, what happened? <laughs> See, Arrow is gonna know. Is he okay? Right? Hey, you've hurt yourself. You're bleeding. Oh my god. <laughs> I, uh, I gotta go. <laughs> he did, he did that action like idea, jump up happened. and grab the, the pipes the on the ceiling. Did he actually Those do that in real life or was he just hallucinating that? Holy shit. <laughs>